Bianca? Did you bring any more food? I'm starving. There's no time for that, Hunter. We have to stop the sorceress. She's gonna kill all the dragon hatchlings. Wait a minute. Why should I trust you? This could be another trap. You're in a cage, you furry numbskull. How can I trap you by letting you out? I don't know. You sorceress types can be sneaky. <sighs> I never thought we were going to hurt the dragons. Come on, we don't have time for this. <laughs> Trust me, but I want to help you stop the sorceress. There's a way to open a hidden portal to her lair, but it'll take some very strong magic. If you can find more of the dragon eggs, I think my magic will be strong enough to open the portal. I'll come find you when you have enough eggs, okay? Well, well, Spyro. Look what I have here. It's a life-size space monkey action figure, complete with a fully operational laser. I'd love to let him out so you can play with him, but the sorceress seems to think he's a menace. Ha <laughs> ha! You've always had a weakness for helping silly little creatures, haven't you, Spyro? Ah, oh, well, I suppose there couldn't be any harm in letting him out. Could there? Woohoo! Ha <laughs> ha! I'm free! Thanks, Spyro. Ooh, say, you ever see a bear dance? <laughs> uh, no? <laughs> well, it's your lucky day! Check this out. <laughs> Quite a dancer, isn't he? Not much stamina, though. Too bad I had a lot more ammo left. <laughs> Anyway, I heard all about how you've been fighting the sorceress and her armies and kicking all that butt, and I just wanted to say, huzzah! Yippee! Woohoo! Wish you could stay, but my homeworld's been overrun by Rhinox since I've been captured. If you happen to see the sorceress, tell her I'll be giving her dancing lessons real soon. Know what I mean? You bet. Later! <laughs> Did you see a Rhinoch? I thought I saw a Rhinoch. Ooh, take it from me, Spyro. Never spend a week in a cage. Mm -hmm. Next thing you know, your whole island will be knee-deep in Rhinox. Well, gotta go. Mr. Laser Blaster and I have a whole lot of work to do. Ah, Agent Nine, my favorite pupil. Welcome back to my island laboratory. I'm afraid Rhinox have taken over the entire island. Could you stop them before they destroy all my research? Ooh. It'll be just like old times. Try shooting these dummies to get warmed up, but uh, be careful. I think a Rhinox might be hiding amongst them.
number of Rhinox are waiting to ambush us as soon as I lower this force field. I expect they'll keep coming until you shoot the red panic button next to the door where they emerge. Indicators show that a bunch of Rhinox are hiding behind the display screen. I'll switch on the view pedestal, and you shoot them as they attack. I recommend using your sniper mode. Let's see what kind of shape the machine room is in. I have a feeling the Rhinox haven't been keeping it too clean. The machine room is overrun with birds. To target the birds in their nests, you'll want to use sniper mode. Then zoom in for pinpoint accuracy. This is a bird egg or dragon egg. Uh, what do you think? <laughs> now I can switch the gravitonometric generator back on. I hope no birds got in here. Smells better in here already. Uh, follow me outside where I expect we'll find some Rhinox wearing armor. You'll need a more powerful weapon to defeat them.
calculations, the bombs in this handy vending machine should be highly effective against armor. Give it a shot. much for saving my laboratory. Now I can resume thinking. and seek with my friends. If I can't find where they've hidden their heads, they won't let me join the Tiki Lodge. Help me put them back together and I'll make you an honorary member.
is a sign of your honorary membership to the Lodge. Well, that's never happened before. I hope it's not a bad omen. Spyro, I found an egg, but only Sparks will be able to reach it. There's a small hole that leads to a crawdad farm. I can take him there if he's ready. Hello, Sparks. Before you take on those nasty crawdads, I should give you some help. To start, let's practice shooting. Press the attack button to shoot these targets. You can also move quickly by pressing the charge button, like Spyro. Use your charge to chase down this fast enemy. Now for the hard part. Being a maneuverable dragonfly, you can also strafe in any direction. To strafe, hold down the roll left or roll right button, then move with the left stick. Try strafing to hit the targets in this room. Butterflies that give you health, just like in the dragon world. Not only that, but some butterflies will give you special powers, though only for a short time. Just eat any power-up butterfly, then press the jump button to use that power-up. Your power-up is shown in the top right of the screen. If you need any more guidance, just choose the controls option from the pause menu.
fine day for a bit of a walk. I was just heading to the top of my favourite hill. Hey, I think I saw some Rhinox run up to the top of that hill with an egg. Another lost egg. If Sparks is up to it, he can try to rescue it from Spider Town.
bro. I'm helping a kid named Handel recover some secret rocket plans the sorceress stole. You know I'm always ready to kick some Rhinoc booty. Hi, Agent Nine. Behind those doors are some pretty scary ninjas. I bet you could use your sharpshooter skills to take them out. Remember, press the attack button to shoot, and use the roll left and roll right buttons to dodge left and right.
the say for the Rhinox try to blow that up too.
There's a really big sheep UFO around here, and it's trying to get me. I snatched up a dragon egg and I'm trying to abduct, and now it wants revenge. You wait here, I'll lure the UFO down the river of honey. Okay, here I go. is a cheetah. And look, I didn't even drop the egg. showed me a place called Starfish Reef. She said there's an egg hidden in there. I think Sparks should check it out.
Where do these flying sheep saucers keep coming from? I just saw another one grab an egg and fly off. This one's super fast, but his saucer is damaged and it's leaving smoke rings. I think I can keep up with them as long as I can make it through those rings. I'm gonna chase him down. I'll be right back. Close. The egg popped out just before the saucer crash landed. But we were stolen some magic from the sorceress. We're hiding here whilst we are practice of using it. Unfortunately, we've had the beat of an accident and turned everything into crystal, and it seems to have aggravated the indigenous creatures.
see a magic trick? Watch carefully. As you can see, there is nothing up my left sleeve and nothing up my right sleeve. But now, with a wave of my hands and the magic word, Alakazam! the trick again? Well, all right. But I want you to know this isn't as easy as it looks. You know, which is why I'm going to start the whirlwind over there. Abracadabra! <laughs> Spyro, did you know I happen to be a very amateur magician. My specialty is the uh, amazing extending bridge trick. I'd love to show you, but I'll need a small donation first. For my expenses, you understand. Very good. Ha, ah, let's see. Hocus Pocus, Ziggledy Zen, make this bridge get long again. suppose I could show you my new trick. As long as you promise not to tell the great Zamboni, he steals all my best work. Alakazam! I was going to use it in a trick, but uh, my magic, it just keeps bouncing off.
Cody means Spyro. The amazing Rendini is about to put on a display of prestidigitation. I've heard it's quite impressive, so I'm going to watch the show. my magic show seems to have overexcited them all. All they need is a good bonker on the head to calm them down. And you look like just the Yeti to help. A light tap on the head should sort them out. But be careful, my friends are trying to burrow after them. One of my friends dug this up whilst chasing the moles. <laughs> 